I'm Shay, and welcome back to part two of my Q&A, where I asked my community uh, if they had any questions for me and to get to know me better, because I want to get to know you guys better. And this part is about knife and some gaming. But I have a part one where it has a lot about gaming, so go check that one out and let's get into it. So this game is Monument Valley. It's a puzzle game, so... Slowly but surely, we will make our way through these questions and make our way through the labyrinth, I guess. So let's do it. Okay, first question. What instrument is your favorite to play? Good question. My favorite instrument to play is the trumpet. I am... I'd say, I'd say I'm pretty good at trumpet. Um... I played for, oh my god. So I've been playing trumpet for 15 years now. It's really fun, I really enjoy it. I did a lot of brass sections. Um, I was in orchestra, wind ensemble, marching band, chamber ensemble, which isn't really for brass, but jazz band, concert band, state band, town band, regional band, shoreline band, so many, so, so many. And it's, it's just so much fun. Like when you get off the stage or you're still on the stage and you hear the audience just like cheering for you, like the crowd goes roaring, like that's a real thing. That's a real thing. It's so cool to experience the like euphoria after you just finish a concert. So my first and favorite instrument is the trumpet. Do you want to see them? I'll show you. I'll show you. So this one is my normal trumpet. I have, so this is my original trumpet. I got this one in like sixth grade, maybe even fifth grade, but here it is. It's silver. It's very nice. I love it so much. It's a Jean-Baptiste. Um, it has these cute little... You can't really see it, but it has very, very pretty engravings on it. Um, the bell got a little dented because someone dropped my trumpet. It was not me. And it went boom! Right into the floor. Feels bad, but I love it. I won't play it now, but maybe in the future. And then... I have a piccolo trumpet, which is really interesting. It's like, it's kind of a baby trumpet. It has little, little valves, but it has four of them instead of the normal three. And having four valves allows, where is the zipper? Allows um, higher octaves to be reached. Here it is. Another silver, but it has little gold little gold stuffs in it. I love it. I love it so much. I think I got this one for Christmas one year or my birthday. So amazing. Yeah, I love that one so much. I also have another trumpet, a trombone. This is only brass. Trumpet, trombone, pocket trumpet, which is an actual trumpet just all spaghettified, you know. Very spaghetti in that in that sense. So yeah, I also have so many other instruments in my house. I got a piano, I got an organ, I got so many guitars, basses, clarinets, you know, whatever, <laughs> whatever. Big musician. I play, I play a lot of things. Big musician. I just love music. Okay, next question. Are you classically trained with all of them? No. So I only am classically trained in trumpet. And that's okay. That's quite all right. Ooh, I don't know what to do here. I took, I took private lessons for trumpet. I was originally going to, oh, here we go. I was originally going to go to college for music so that's why i had private lessons and i was trained very very hard 
worked very, very hard for it. And I mean, I didn't end up going to going to college for music, but that's okay. I don't think I would. I don't think I would. Um, the music orchestral scene is just too cutthroat for me. I just want to play my instrument, you know? That's fine. Which instrument did you learn first? Hmm. A recorder? <laughs> Does everyone learn the recorder first? I feel that. But no, I taught myself when I was really little, I taught myself how to play piano. Um, and like learn things by ear because I was like, what else am I gonna do? What else am I gonna do here? So the way I taught myself piano is I started with C, which is the first note in the scale. And so I would write it down on a piece of paper and put that strip of paper over the piano buttons, piano buttons, piano keys. And I would be like, okay, so if I wanted to play hot cross buns, if I wanted to play hot cross buns, then, oh, 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 wait, no. Then I would go E, D, C, E, D, C, and E was three, D was two, and C was one. So C, one, D, two, E, three, F, four, G, five, A, six, B, seven, C, on the next scale would be eight. So that's kind of how I figured things out by ear. Which is pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty fun. I had a good time. And... What are we supposed to do? Oh, 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 wait, I know how to do this. I know this. Okay, this one, you wanna do that? That was very fun. I like that a lot. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Next question. Have you done any sports? Have I done any sports is the question. Yes, I have done many, many sports. Um, many, many, many. What are we doing? We're putting this here. My first sport... My first sport was soccer. And I would do like the park and rec soccer every Saturday or something. And then I did horseback riding. And horseback riding was really, really fun. But... I had to change and make the decision, the executive decision, to not horseback ride anymore after my family decided that they were gonna do archery. So we do, we are an archery household. I know many 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 archers i even know the ones in the olympics this year which is incredibly exciting very very exciting so i've competed at a national level my sisters competed at national and international levels i don't know big lore we're we're a an archery family very very cool now you do that now you do this now you go woohoo and then we go oh no and then we pop it down there. Oh no, I messed up. Oh yeah, 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 okay. So, big archery family. Big into sports. I mean, I'm not really that much into sports, but I really like the Olympics. I'm very excited to see the Olympics soon. Next question. <laughs> Do you sing? Uh, I'd like to say that I can. I don't know, I'm not like anything special or anything unique, but I do like to sing. I did karaoke once. I did Lost Cause by Billie Eilish. You know, that's not, that's not a good karaoke song. If I were to do another karaoke session, I would do We Are Young, holy cow. I would do We Are Young by Fun, because I was obsessed with that song, especially the Glee rendition. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> also got my chai, let's freaking go. It's a special day. It's a special day. Where am I? Oh, come on, buddy. We're the bird. We're the bird whisperer. All right. Next question. <laughs> what movie slash TV show slash game were you super hyped for but ended up a huge disappointment? Good one. So I don't have a movie for this one, but I have a TV show, which is most people's disappointing TV shows is season seven and eight of 
Game of Thrones. I was not a huge fan. I was very, very excited to see how it ended, but it all just seemed a little forced, a little forced. And even, even the actors know, <clears throat> even the actors are like very aware of that, you know? So feels bad, but what are you gonna do? Oh, oh thank you, Barty. What are you gonna do? And for a game, for game that I was disappointed in, it's gotta be Starfield. It's gotta be Starfield. I played that game. I even finished that game. I even finished that game because I was waiting, oh God. I was waiting for it to just like click in my brain. Like, oh, this game is great because I love space. Oh shoot. I love space, but it just wasn't it. It just wasn't it. Like, Bethesda basically made it seem like it was gonna be Skyrim in space, but it was not Skyrim in space. I did not feel like I was having fun. Ugh. And everything was, what is it? AI generated or some, some other generation. Like when you get to a planet on Starfield, the structures are just randomly generated. There's no sense of being like to your friends. You turn to your friends and you're like, yo, did you do like, did you go to the the Dark Brotherhood fortress or whatever? And then you're like, no, I didn't see it. Cause in Starfield, it's just randomly generated. So none of the nostalgia and awareness and relationness I don't know it's just not relatable like you can't relate to your friends about this game oh no oh I see you can't relate to anyone about Starfield unless you had a bad time playing it sorry 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 I'm sorry <laughs> I just was so excited for that game anyways next question if you didn't study environmental horticulture, what other field would you have gone into? Good question. So I touched upon this a little bit before, um, saying that I would have gone to school for music, but that was just when I was like really in the zone for playing my instrument. I originally started going to college as an astronomy major because I love space, I love astronomy, I love physics, I love learning about that stuff. I want to ultimately grow, grow plants in space or learn how to not grow plants specifically in space, like in the International Space Station, but I would love to research how to terraform other planets. Think of The Martian, if you've seen The Martian or read The Martian, something like that. So I think that would be very cool. But because that didn't end up working out, I now went for horticulture, which is honestly the, the next best thing. Because if I, if I learn how to grow plants and help them sustain themselves, then I can ultimately research how to grow plants in space and help the plants there on how to sustain themselves you know could be cool could be cool I'm I'm excited for the rest of my educational career if it does end up working out you know but life is life we will learn together one by one next question can you RKO Pikachu now if you don't know I have little Pokemons behind me, right? They have little, little guys behind me. And this is Pikachu. This is Pikachu. And one of my community members would love to see me RKO Pikachu. So <laughs> this one's for you. <gasps> yep. This is what Faneuil wants me to do to my Pikachu. 
one's for you. <laughs> no. He's so good. He's so good. All right, next question. The mass of the sun. Now, we were just talking about physics, too, so what do you know? The mass of the sun is 1.989 times 10 to the 30th kilograms. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's really thick and very heavy. So, thanks for that question. <laughs> Next question. How much life experience and tasty treats do you think you've missed out on by lacking a microwave? Listen, for some insight, I don't have a microwave. I didn't grow up with a microwave. I don't feel like I'm missing out because some of my friends have microwaves, so I sometimes use theirs and my go-to is like P.F. Chang's beef and broccoli or something. But I don't feel like I've missed out on a lot of sweet treats. Unless you would call the cookie that I put in the microwave for a minute missing out. Which I kind of messed up on. But it's okay. When I, was in, when I was in school, in my dorm room, I had a... I did have a microwave. And I, I, I mean, I didn't grow up with one. I don't really know how to use it. This level is so cool. I thought it was completely acceptable to put the cookie in the microwave for a minute. How was I supposed to know? <laughs> so when I did that, the fire fire department had to come to my dorm room. <laughs> and the, it was blaring, it was loud, it was great. I had a great time. But, uh, yeah, don't do that. Put a cookie in the microwave for... Oh, where are we going? Like, ten seconds, maybe? I don't know, I wouldn't listen to me. <laughs> oh, where are we going? Oh. This is so cool! I love this game. Very cute. Where are we going? Oh, we gotta go back. So yeah, that's my microwave experience. I still don't have one. Maybe I'll get one in the future. Whatever, whatever. Next question. What are your favorite flowers? I have one with me right now. This is one of my favorite flowers. It's an orchid. Very cute. Very, very cute here at Tab Dinner. I love it. It's a little dusty. Oh God, it's okay. I love it. I got this one uh, last year for my birthday. This is my orchid. It's a moth orchid. Oh my god. I recently went to the New York Botanical Garden when they had an orchid show and everything was so, so beautiful. There were so many orchids. Fun fact. Free plant fact. <laughs> orchids are epiphytes, which means they have very thick roots and they can grow on trees very good they can grow on anything so that's why they have really thick bark it's good also one of my other favorite plants are a tulip poplar it's a tree so tulip poplar is a tree but they have very very beautiful blooms and you know they look like tulips they're very cute they're like white and orange so if you don't know i highly recommend Okay, next question. Yes, next question is my favorite plant. This is my favorite plant. I'll tab out for this one. This is my favorite plant. This is my jade plant. I got her when I was a freshman in college. And they were doing like a, a meet and greet or something. Icebreaker challenge at the dorm. And she was, she was so small. She was like a little... She was the ugly duckling, I must say. But I love you so much very cute and she was so tiny but she grew so well into herself i kind of have to i definitely do have to uh repot her but she has a little friend she has a little friend it's a kodama it's a kodama from princess mononoke and they're forest spirits they're forest spirits and i love them love them next up we have 
If you never got into music, what form of art would you have focused on as an alternative? I would focus on painting. I really, really enjoy painting. I love painting. I would probably do watercolors specifically. And, oh, uh, last question for the Q&A. What excites you about the future of my streaming career? Well, I have a lot, a lot of games to play. We're gonna play Cyberpunk. We're gonna play Nier. We're gonna play Sekiro. What else did we get? We got The Witcher. We have Bioshock. We got Portal. I'm so excited for that. Oh, look at the fishies. So, so excited for that. This level is so cool. And yeah, I'd like to do more IRL things. We recently got a gaming laptop, which allows me to, <gasps> no, he's got dirt on him, which allows me to maybe even go outside and like show you the plants that I have outside. And yeah, it's just, it's just been such a wholesome journey so far. We're, we are nine months in to streaming and just doing it, starting the adventure again. Each and every one of you has been so, so wonderful. Like I can't, I can't be more grateful. It's just, I'm just so grateful for you guys. I love it, I love it, I love it. And I'm really excited to just make you all proud and play some games for you. Maybe it'll also be your first experience. We're also playing Final Fantasy. All these games are my first experience too. So hopefully it'll be good and we'll have fun. And yeah, I'm just excited for the future of all of us. So let's freaking go. Thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I just wanna watch the end of this. This is so beautiful. Yes, we got Final Fantasy, very excited, Sekiro, more Souls games to come. I want to play Dark Souls 3. I'm not sure if I could get into DS1 or DS2, but I'm really excited to experience everything with you guys and just have a good time. All I strive to do is make you guys smile, make you guys feel comfortable, because you guys make me feel comfortable. I couldn't be more grateful for every single one of you guys. Thank you for being part of my community and letting me do this. Just talk to you, get to know you. It's so good. I'm having such a good time. I'm having such a good time and I hope you are too. So yes, thank you for watching. That was part two of my Q&A. So hopefully you learned something about me. I would love to learn more things about you. So if you want to answer the same questions down below in the comment section, go for it. I love it. I will probably remember it. And if you come in chat, I'll ask you about things. So yeah, just thank you. I adore every single one of you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you everyone.